So adult acne, yes, it usually arises when we become adults at puberty. It's usually estrogen, high estrogen that is the causing of this. Dr. John Lee is probably the first doctor that blew the whistle on this hormonal imbalance. And he shows that when we apply the wild yam cream, the fat cells take that diostin enough, which is the plant chemical in the wild yam, and little by little, it causes a rise in progesterone. That brings the estrogen back down in the level that it should be. At the same time... It's so let's talk about wild yam and how if this cream actually works for hormonal acne. It sounds fancy, right? But here's a key thing. Diastogen is not a hormone. Your body can't magically turn it into estrogen, progesterone, and just because you rub it on the face, it doesn't do anything. There's zero evidence out there, and I mean zero clinical trials when I try to look for this, showing wild yam cream helps with acne. There's no studies in dermatology or journals. The most I found was this clinical trial for wild yam and menopause symptoms. And even this one showed no change in estrogen, progesterone, or other hormones. So it's definitely not rebalancing your hormones or controlling your oil glands. And the dermatology guidelines, like the one from the Journal of the European Academy of Dermatology, there's been proven acne treatments out there. For example, topical retinoids, benzoproxide, antibiotics, hormonal therapies. So if you're seeing wild yam creams marketed for hormonal acne, it's not science, that's marketing. Save your money, follow the evidence, and if you're struggling with acne, talk to your dermatologist. But treatments that actually work. And hey, if you love myth-busting skin science, hit that follow button and more evidence-based skincare facts.